main purpose of manufacturing is exposing kids uh, to tools of the new manufacturing trade and learning how to use those tools properly and to be able to create something that they can be proud of to take home. So this class is called Guitar for Fun. Um, it requires no experience on guitars. We have guitars that um, students can use in the class. Um, or you could be somebody who has played guitar for a really long time and it provides an opportunity for you to play um, in a pretty low pressure environment. There aren't any public performances, which some people like about being able to learn music without having to stress out about that. Um, and each student in the class pretty much gets to do whatever they're most interested in. So we go over basic guitar skills and um, then they get to choose songs that they like. Um, and most people are, are pretty successful with that. The purpose of foods as a class is to um, work together in teams to create delicious, beautiful meals and then eat them. A lot of athletes or a lot of students who are involved in fitness or want to be involved in fitness take what's called advanced conditioning. And that's a class that I really enjoy teaching because you have motivated students, students who for the most part want to be there, um, that use that class as an extension of their training as athletes. And that class will have about 45 minutes of weight training time and then we'll do other training activities along the, during the course of the class. So this is metals fabrication. We do things like uh, make furniture, skate rails, sculpture, kind of whatever, whatever you want to do. We teach welding, a lot of metalworking fabrication skills, and then once you have the skills, you do a project that's your own creation. This class, there's there's no papers, there's no homework, it's just all about working in the metal shop. You get to beat on stuff, you get to work with fire, so it's different, it's fun. So it's a production jewelry class, you're learning all the skills you need to um, kind of make most anything you could want in jewelry. Well, cinema is a fabulous class because you watch films and you have a little notebook that you keep when you do a final project on one film that you really love. But it's a great class. You get to re see all the classic films. And then you also see a whole, but the last month you see all modern films and mostly some screeners that I have access to that are new. So it's a great class. You should take it. Politics and Literature is a year-long survey of classics, both nonfiction and fiction, that uh, come from the Western political tradition. We do a lot of things. We read what I consider to be the essential texts in uh, political philosophy, things by Aristotle, uh, Thomas Hobbes, he wrote The Leviathan, John Locke uh, from his second treatise of government. Uh, the literature in there has really good variety. It's incredibly enjoyable. My students seem to respond really well to it. But the bottom line is, I try to get students to think about what is politics? What does it have to do with their, uh, with their life? What have people uh, for the last 2,000 years said uh, that uh, politics and life have to do with one another?